Hi everyone, it's James. Today I have a little problem. It's about my visa. As you know, I'm a Canadian and uh, I also have a Japanese permanent residence visa, which is called Ajuken in Japanese. And um, this is my old Canadian passport. It expired last year and uh, it has all my, me luck. Cross uh, my fingers. Japanese paperwork to be legal in this country. This is my new Canadian passport. It doesn't have any Japanese documentation. I need to go to the Kobe Immigration Office this morning because I'm leaving for Canada pretty soon. If I don't have any Japanese paperwork on this new Canadian passport, I won't be allowed to re-enter Japan. So we'll see how it goes. So look at my old Canadian passport. Inside it has a permanent residence sticker. I need to have that on to my new Canadian passport. I'm in downtown Kobe and I'm heading to the immigration office. Over there in the distance is the Kobe immigration office, that ugly brown building. You know, they might not let me film inside. Look at it. I have to sign in. I got one of these cards. Tight security. There it is. So I was just told by the lady that I don't need to have a stamp on my new passport. You know, a new development, I was just told by the lady who works here that I don't need a stamp on my new passport. This is my old passport, it has a stamp. But with the new kind of passport, the new system, I just need my permanent residence card, which is a gaijin card. It's called a Zaidio card and it says my status in Japan. So I need that plus my passport when I leave and come back to Japan. And that's it for this video. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up and we'll see you again. Bye.